it's a pop-up ambulance. Hey, everybody, it's Matthew Reinhardt. Let's make it pop. We're going to make our very own pop-up ambulance. Here, there's a template down below. There's a link. You can click on it, download those templates, and then you can print them out onto cardstock. Now, you're going to see on these templates, there are two different types of black lines. Now, these are not my hands. These are, these are Kirsten. She helps me out. Say hi, Kirsten. Hi. There, she said hi. Um, anyhow, she is doing an amazing job of scoring with a large paper clip and a ruler. And what she's doing is she's rubbing the edge of the paper clip along every dotted line. And what that's doing is that's going to prepare the paper to fold. It'll fold much better. So you can see that she's just laying the edge of the ruler right on it, pressing down with the side of the paper clip. And all of those dotted lines are going to get scored. So be sure to take your time, do it just right. Next, we're gonna follow all the solid black lines and we're gonna cut with a pair of scissors. Be very careful. You can see that Kristen is really smart the way she cuts out paper. She actually moves the paper rather than moving her scissors. So that way it's more comfortable for her to cut out pieces. Sometimes when there's a lot of different pieces on a, on a, a page like this, um, what we'll do is we'll cut out just a small piece and then do all the detail work um, on each one of the pieces. So we'll just cut apart all these different pieces so we don't accidentally cut through one of the other pieces. And that way each um, single piece has its own, you know, area that we have to cut out. This is the smart way to cut out pop-up pieces, right? We gotta be patient. She can follow along all the solid lines very, very carefully with her scissors and cut out all these pop-up pieces. Okay, for this really strange kind of diamondish shape piece, what we're actually gonna do is before we start cutting out that slot that's in the center, see it's really hard to get at it. You can't get at it from the outside edges, but we'll all there's a fold line in the center, so we're just gonna fold it in the center. Now we can really easily cut out that slot, just like that. Thanks, Kirsten. And then we just keep on cutting until we cut out all the other pieces. Oh, there they are. There's one, two, three, four, five, six pieces plus the base page. All right, now we're gonna pre-fold some of these pieces. So what, what she's doing is she's, she's folding the paper to kind of let it know where, which way it's gonna go. And because we scored all those, those different pieces, it's really easy to fold on those dotted lines. So just follow along and fold, pre-fold all these pieces just like she's showing us. To make sure that all those hinges, see those are actually hinges on the pop-up pieces so that they move really, really well. Yes, we need to fold along some of these long lines and this one and this one. Now when we are building this pop-up um, ambulance, some of, these, some of the gray pieces that you see, those are gonna go on the inside so we don't see them. All right, to assemble the pop-up pieces, we have to use some glue. We're gonna use some craft glue, just regular old white Elmer's glue or whatever you got. And um, we're gonna glue together. There's this piece here. Now you can see, we can see each tab is labeled A, B, C, D, et cetera, et cetera. And there are little gray spots that, um, that correspond to each letter. So we're gonna glue on tabs A and B just right here. See, that's where they go. And we're gonna glue them in place and let them dry for a little bit. Press it down, make sure they're just in place. All right, so once you've glued these pieces together, there's actually three pieces that are glued together. Now it's time, since it's all flat, this might be a really good time to decorate. All right, so you can use markers, crayons, colored pencils, anything. Um, to decorate and here are the different sides so you can see Kristen has drawn different things There's this is the front of the car the side of the car You can see kind of how she has decorated it so that to give you a little bit of a guide see there's the um, There's the the front of the car there and the headlights and ooh, don't forget the ambulance It needs its sirens up the top see look at she's even put some rescue workers inside the ambulance look at them There she is waving now let's finish gluing together our pop-up. So let's glue tab C in place. So see, there's the little gray spot. It goes just right there. Let's glue it into place. And remember, don't you know squeeze a lot of glue into that area. Make sure that you kind of paint it in there and get it just right in place, just like that. Let it dry, press it down, make sure it's good and stuck. 
Now let's glue another tab down. Let's glue the tabs down to the base page. You're going to see that these tabs actually correspond with um, the shapes on the base page. So there you can see just in place there's one tab and there's the other tab. And we're just putting a little glue inside those different spaces. That tab fits exactly just like that. So this side will go right here and this side will go right here. Perfect. Press them down. Make sure they're nice and glued. Make sure that they're straight too. Make sure that they're not lopsided. All right. Now, see this piece here? See that little triangle? That's, that tab is going to glue in right there. And we're just going to use some glue on the glue gray spot. We're going to tape that tab down. Look at that. It fits right there. Perfect. See, we wanted to make this easy for you. Now we're going to tape this tab down. Oh, see it goes right there underneath that little area. See, she folded it up. So we're going to actually put some glue on the top here on this side. And we're going to glue it down to that folded up roof of the ambulance, just like that. should fit perfectly in place. And now we're going to glue this side. Oop, see this tab here? That needs to glue to the front of our ambulance right there. There's a tab space just right there for it. Let's fold it around. See how it goes right there? Put a little glue on the tab. Got to make sure it sticks together. Now you can use double stick tape if you'd like, if you don't have glue. But if you do that, um, you have to make sure that none of your double stick is outside of the little tab. Because if you use too much, your whole pop-up will stick together. All right, so we glued that tab in place. We're getting there. We're almost done. Oh, I'm so excited. There's this big tab. See that tab right here? That tab's going to go on the back of the ambulance. See, there's a big gray space right there. Look at that. That's perfect for it. So let's put some glue right on the tab. Fold it in. We're going to press it into place right there. and pinch it, make sure it stays in place. Now this piece here, this is the back door, and you're gonna see that the tab fits exactly on this space right there. So we're gonna put some glue down, just like that, on that tab, that weird sort of um, trapezoidal shape. Hopefully I said the right thing. Let's see, we're gonna glue it into place. See how she's glued it right there and the tab fits right on that edge for those doors? We can flatten our pop-up. Look at that. It all fits inside. We are good at making pop-ups. Oh, but we're missing one piece. Let's see. Let's see how that door works. We can open it up. Hey, what's going on? See, look at that. That's so cool. All right. Now we just have this one last piece. Now see that slot? We're actually going to slide the slot over that little white area right there. So we're just going to carefully slide it over and you can kind of pull it over it. And it should rest in place just like that. And now, there you got it. You've made your very own, whoa, your very own pop-up ambulance. Look at that. Wow, to the rescue, right? Good thing we've got a cool pop-up ambulance like this. We'll be able to help anyone who's in trouble. Woo, woo, woo. I thought it was a real ambulance. Look at that. Oh my gosh, we made our very own pop-up ambulance. I love it. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. Well, I hope you've enjoyed making today's Let's Make It Pop pop-up ambulance. And remember to thank any rescue workers that you see for all the hard work that they do and everything that they, they do to keep us safe. All right, this is Matthew Reinhardt saying, let's make it pop. Hey, if you like the, making this craft or you want to make more, um, be sure to hit like and subscribe. And um, if you want to hit the bell, uh, you'll know anytime uh, a new video comes out on my channel. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.